should Hillary Clinton run for president and win, I think you'd see a lot of con basic continuity in, in policy. I think um, Clinton would be more willing, uh, I believe, than Obama has been to spend political capital in the United States explaining to Americans why Asia is important to them, why it's important to their family, why it's important to their jobs, why it's important to their future. Um, and I think that sort of spending of political capital domestically in the United States is absolutely a, an essential down payment for a more engaged uh, foreign policy, a true, a true follow through, if you will, on this pivot or rebalance. Because it'll, it'll convince Americans that we do need to spend uh, more on uh, investing in security. This, this isn't confrontational security. It's, um, it's supporting uh, American uh, uh, military and security presence in the region to prevent um, uh, disasters uh, or respond to disasters like we did in Haiyan or the tsunamis uh, in the 90s uh, or in the early uh, uh, 2000, uh, it was 2004, I believe. Um, but I think the, uh, that kind of commitment by the American people is sort of what's missing right now. Mm -hmm. There's an elite policy level uh, commitment to, I think, a, a, a strategy that Hillary Clinton would c continue. But what hasn't been done is a, a solid marketing job <laughs> or educational job uh, to explain to Americans why we need these trade agreements, why we need to invest in security in Asia. And, um, I have to tell you, you know, as a person who does this for a living, and I look at the geopolitical math all the time. It's compelling. There's no question if you took this argument to Americans that they would be able to understand it and support it. And is that not something that the current administration is doing? Not well effectively enough. enough. I, you know, three. Uh, there have been three speeches by national security advisors. There's been uh, the case has been made by secretaries of state. Um, but what's missing, honestly, mm -hmm. is having the President of the United States on American soil make the case that Asia is fundamentally important to our future. He does it when he travels. Yeah. Uh, he'll do it in the Tokyo and Singapore and the Philippines. He's um, gonna do it. But he hasn't done it in Ohio or Dallas, Texas or, uh, or uh, Sacramento, California. Mm -hmm. that's, the, that's the issue.